Colorado visitors who have experienced its gorgeous scenery, delicious food, and awesome attractions already know one thing. Colorado rocks! Colorado rocks! Colorado rocks! Colorado rocks! <laughs> if you're going to Colorado, the place to start is on the ski slopes. It's early morning in Winter Park, Colorado, and we are up and at them ready to hit the slopes for a family ski lesson. I'm very curious to see how this one is going to go. What is it that you like about teaching skiing? You know, teaching skiing to me is always, always a different challenge every day, and the challenges change throughout the day. Um, I have young kids up to adults that might have different experiences in their background, so, you know, trying to have them love the sport as much as I do um, can be a challenge, but it's also really rewarding. What differences are there in teaching adults and in teaching kids? Uh, you know, the differences primarily between kids and adults are their, their physical differences and their, you know, just their emotional and, and their mental understanding. Um, typically with kids, it's more of the adventure, play, fun, idea and you know depending on the adult it might be similar but it also might be a little bit more technical um, just depending on their background um, they have different different realities different fears um, so that's some of the major differences do you ever have someone and you just like you know what go home you're just never gonna get it you know that's a joke that I might have with somebody but it's never never been the experience um, there's always something that they can get out of it. Um, it might be at a different level of, of success, but they can always be successful. On the next Loves a Trip, take a bite out of Colorado's food scene. 